on screen. She hung it up slightly, but here we go. The fastest mum in the world, Rachel Afferton, leaves the Star Hut. What can she do this afternoon? Is she going to get that 41st UCI World <laughs> Cup downhill win? It's like she's never been away. Rachel Afferton on track for Afferton Continental. So good to see her back. And we missed her. I we have missed her. We <laughs> have missed her. The level that she brings to it, 1.4 seconds at the first split. <laughs> oh, you can't see it beside me. Cedric nearly did a comedy sort of like. He took a drink and it all nearly came flying out there as Rachel Alford and turned the split green. I mean, in 1.4 in the first section. Come on. At a race at the start of the year, she wasn't even sure if she was going to actually compete and she wasn't even sure in Lea Gang if she was going to compete in this one. And she's just found 1.4 seconds at the wow. first split. Oh, the same lines and Gabiru here. What they have done on that bike to go so fast. Rachel Afford in version 2.0 is a very, very fast thing. Now, this is where we've heard it's crucial to nail oh, these landings. 2.8. Oh, 2.8 for Afferton. Has to duck round that second booter. Yes. It's scruffy on the motorway for Afferton, but she gets the cranks in there, just sitting down, catching her breath slightly. Yeah, didn't take that big jump. We see if it affects her, but she had 2.8 in the green on split two. She's been absolutely loving her time back amongst the downhill fraternity, back amongst the routine, the mental battles that all add up to a race winning run. What is the third split going to say for Rachel Afferton now? We're in Through the soon section. We're in the soon now. After that tunnel. 1.6. She lost. She lost time there. Rachel Afferton then. She oh. has time to play with as she heads into the woods. Oh, nice. You see the way, like she's using the brake. She's not braking really hard. She's like sadly touching the brake, really gentle. Be careful on that inside corner oh. here. You see, and she went full committed. Wow. Oh, inside line. Under the 50 kilometers an hour mark. 1.6 back for, for Afford and she's making it. Oh yeah. It's moving. It's 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 2.5 right now for Rachel Afferton. Wow. Rachel Afferton looking to displace Phoebe Gale. A 35-year-old is about to take out an 18-year-old from the hot seat. Oh, and dirt flying. She is loving being back on a downhill bike. And an extension of that is being love and being back at the race as Rachel Afferton gets her gets her Afferton bike nicely around that rope. And here she oh, comes. Like she like took the foot off on the on the corner. Is she gonna add to her tally of three wins here in Lea Gang and make it number four? There's plenty of riders to come, come yet. On. But Rachel Afferton goes into the hot seat by half a second. I lost by Downhill World Cup. Well, this woman has won a few in her time, Camille Balanche. For Switzerland, last year's overall title holder, leaves the Star Hub. This first split will be interesting. Does she have a point to make today? She wanted to be back in the game. Last week was hard for her to swallow the pill. The first woman, the first Swiss woman, excuse me, to win a UCI gold medal. 2022, she's back, 0.3 seconds. Yes. But uh, it's in touch, it's in touch, because it's, still a lot. A, a, Still a lot of corners. It's something to build on, isn't it? Something to build on as she heads down into this first tricky route section. Oh, a little bit of hard time here. She has to go over that big stump. Then into the lower. All the winners' names of this historic track immortalized on those stumps to the right-hand side of that last shot. But here she yes. comes. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, like sharp corner here. Yep. Through Doubling there. out. Now, how precise can Camille Balanche be? On oh, these she's jumps. gone green. She's gone green. She's one tenth of the second to the good. Ooh. Yep, those have both worked for her. Those two jumps crucial to get the speed onto the second half of this motorway section to carry it the whole way down. And they're big. Balanche is looking good here, you know, Cedric. Yes, yes, she like you know, she's tacking using the, the backside of the jump. Oh, she's sending it to Whoa. flat! And then Whoa. just bubbled into that hole there. I wonder how much time that's cost her, the 33-year-old. Oh, she definitely bat him out. Everything on that jump. Yeah, but she's kept moving. The next split will be pivotal for Camille oh, Balanche. We, we will not soon after the tunnel. 
Here she comes out of the tunnel lane, on the wall oh. right, she's still faster, she's yes. down speed. Yes. Half a second now to the good for Camille Balanche. We saw a look of almost confusion on her face, never Rachel Afferton took that win last time out in Lenzerheide at her home round in her backyard. She'll fancy a bit of vengeance today. Camille Balanche is on track. She's outside the 50 oh. kilometers in our club, but she is moving She's here moving. in Leo Gang. Oh, the corner is getting really well. Oh, all, the way over, line. all the way over to the right hand side. That looks like it's worked well for the defending overall points champ. The bike trying to get out from underneath her there. Balanche says no. She's on the limit. Camille Balanche on a race and run here, seven tenths now. It works, it's working so far. It is working, she doesn't fancy getting beaten by Rachel Afferton again. Over the big gap now. Come on, we all know, we and saw what happened earlier, be careful on those corners. Here they come, two of the most critical turns on the track. Can she lace them together and ride herself into the hot seat? Camille Balanche now, the Swiss woman, on course. Clears one jump, just the final finish line jump to go. Camille Balanche keeping it lit on her oh, way down on. to the line. Camille Balanche Stars. goes fastest in Leo Gang. Valentina Hall it's leaves on. the start hut at home in Leo Gang. She won the qualifying session. She won the semi final session. Oh, she's fast. She's moving fast. And she's in green! Valley Hall would love to win this in front of her friends and family still hunting that first win here in Leo Gang. We're just being told from the bottom of a track, a side wind strong on the start of the motorway section and the last jump. Oh, Moving really left to right in the air on those wooden kickers. Could be pivotal. Let's see if Valley Hall can lace them together. Keeping it low. 1.7 oh. seconds oh, to the she's good. Moving fast. She and did. I can tell you, the finish line section here, the crowd has gone bananas as they've seen the times <laughs> light up. Valley Hall, the drone can't keep up with her. She's on the run, definitely on the run. 1.7 seconds, the Austrian has got time to play with. Millimeter perfect through this jump section. Valentina Hall no, just getting a little here. push from the wind there. Oh, she's moving so quick, jumps are coming so fast to her. Here we go then, Valentina Hall, is she going to get that elusive home win? Can she make it happen today at home? Triples out of the whoop section. Let's see what the third split Whoa! says. Valentina Hall! 3.3! Valentina Hall is tearing them apart in Leo Gang. 3.3 <laughs> seconds! Wow! Oh, I'm standing here entering like, you know, like not jumping so far. 51 kilometers an hour, the fastest we've seen yet. Hall now into this tricky wood section oh. where it all went wrong oh. for Hoffman. <laughs> She's taking the chance. Yep, doubling down through there. Here's that right hander where Hoffman threw it in the scenery. Oh, no problem for her. Hall, absolutely. She is on the mission. She is on a mission here today in Austria. Valentina Hall, the Austrian, the UCI <laughs> world champion, sets about. Opening her UCI Martin Bike World Cup wins the count. She's found a tenth of a second. 3.4 seconds now for Hull. Well, she got down. Faster she goes. Look at the crowd at the bottom of the track. The crowd are going wild down here as Valentina Hull, the local hero. Just these tricky corners to navigate now between her and a home win. Her first of the year. Only two corners left. Oh, she's done, it's good. Valentina Hall. Back on the pedals. Heads down towards the line and Leah Gang. Is it going to be enough to take the win? Come on, Valentina Austria. Valentina Hall crosses the line and Leah Gang. Valentina oh, Hall wins this in Leah Gang. 4.3 <laughs> seconds. 4.3 wow. seconds. Valentina Hall what takes them apart in Leo Gang in Austria. What a run. Valentina Hall smashes the opposition at her home there round and celebrates with friends and family. The crowd are on their feet, downhill racing at its Oh my god, just like Leo Gang is such a hard race for me, like last year was a disaster. I've never been so down and doubted myself and the years before, first injury, then crash in the last corner and Every time I'm so close and it didn't work and after that I had it, I was like lost, I didn't know what to do and it all just clicked this week, like all my friends are here, everyone I love is here and I'm so stoked they're all with me. Lined up from a long time ago, we had a Camille Balanche, Rachel Afford and Monica Rasnick, Phoebe Gale in fifth, in on here, second ever elite World Cup, ahead of Kabiru, Hemstreet, Hoffman and Blewett.